So I was browsing Reddit today, and I came across this one over here. Guild War Against Delicious, Cancerous, Shinja Iris, sounds like me. <laughs> Let's take a look at it. So just some background on this video. Um, this is Mac Mac Gaming. Uh, he's got a channel on YouTube. He's from the Guild of the Thrones, and he attacked us. I'm not sure when, but I'm pretty sure he attacked me. There you go. So he's looking for me right now. That <laughs> you guys always find the ugliest angles of photos and manage to capture them. I tell you. <laughs> Who is he hitting? He's hitting uh, me first, right? I mean, you gotta start with the easiest and, guy. Uh, the for from the world. <laughs> you should have checked set first. He's gonna take out all your units, okay? You should just go start with me. Start. Whoa, whoa, what's that? Start with me. Come on. You you got your thing slick. He already clicked me before. I did that time last time. Okay, so I'm running the wind monkey. So he said he attacked me last time and he lost. So I'm running wind monkey, Rakan, Iris, Molong, Ritesh, Harmonia. I just love Harmonia. You can tell from you know from recent videos that I kind of really like Harmonia. Okay. So let's see what he does against me. He has a Tiana. He has like a Tiana Bomber comp. I think that works. I think that works here, in fact. But not with Varad. Maybe with Tiara. I don't know if he has a Tiara or not. Yeah? Let's see. For the first round, I'm gonna be using uh, Penya, Tassarian, and Heart Angel. Hey, I love you. Wind Panda, Tassarian, Eladrill against Iris. That seems really safe. Not sure how he would. Uh, not sure how he would be able to take out uh, Rakan, but it doesn't matter, I guess, if you if you kill Iris and you can kill uh, Wind Panda early on. I I mean Wind Monkey early on. I guess it's okay. You can you have you know very tanky Elo drill to deal with Rakan, but uh, yeah, because there's no strip, it's a little hard to kill Rakan. Even even no matter how strong uh, a Wind Panda Feng Yan is, right? Wind Is he gonna change the gonna be taking uh He's not changing the second team. Okay, wait one second. You see, I'm not sure you should ever bring a Varad into Ritesh. Ever. Period. <laughs> it doesn't really work out. Unless say you, you you have I don't know, you, you maybe have a Zeros, but then you'd have to be faster than Mo Long because Mo Long could if if Mo Long doesn't derp. 90% of the time Molong derps, but if he doesn't derp, he goes first, he stuns you, right? And then you're in trouble. Anyway, for let's see. Is he gonna stick with this? For my, uh, what do you call this? The main damage dealer. I guess so Steel Mars is okay, because Steel Mars, you know, does first. good damage against me. So we silence Fungi in first, uh, so he cannot cleanse. It's a good thing that Iris didn't uh, silence my. What do Okay, monkey. Oh, Sorry, monkey is violent. Bad. Monkey is doing work. Penyan is in bad shape right now. Monkey cannot clear. He's silent. And th there's a collapse. Okay, okay, <laughs> there's a collapse. So and Fungi is gone. Uh, any Rakan collapse yes. with an armor break on Fungi, it's gonna kill Fungi. But Elijo can revive. But doing so, Elijo gets really low. But we don't get a stun on Elijo. He he violent on stun with the Siren. But the monkey puts armor break on Elijah, he gets a heal off. He gets a heal off on Elijah, we don't have collapse yet. Oh! <laughs> there it is! There's the money shot! So Elijah is down. Not entirely over yet. Not entirely over yet. Okay! Okay! <laughs> now it's over! I don't know if it dies or not. I mean, if you, if you quit now, does the Wind Panda die? Because you should quit now, it's over. It's gonna end my... Yeah, that's the right move. Just gonna say Rakan did work. I mean, Wind Monkey did most of the work. Okay, see, we didn't derp here, we started off with a stun. We got Theobars, that was fortunate. We got Theobars, and we get immunity, but, but Harmonia violence out of immunity because you're stupid, right? So she's gonna get a freeze. Nope, it did not proc a freeze. We did not get a provoke. We did not get a provoke, but we did go twice. It's funny how my retest doesn't do provoke. 
gonna Yeah, gonna but you see, every other retest that attacks me always gets a provoke up. He gets the three man freeze even on to retest. This is looking good for him, but Harmonia resists all the armor break because of really high resistance, right? She violence out of freeze into unwanted harmony. And Chasun is half health now, but I think Chasun has fallen blossom. I think she does. Yeah? She can choose to amuse, she doesn't need to fallen blossom. Trick off win finally from Ritesh. Triple armor break. No violent proc. Immunity into violent proc. Oh, reckless assault, we popped in the arm. Now he's in a really tricky situation. He can't freeze Ritesh. That's the thing because of the immunity, right? So you can do fallen blossoms and heal up Chasun. But if you do so, you're left with a dead Theomarsh, pretty much. You're fucked! Look at his face! <laughs> he knows he's fucked! <laughs> he's trying to work it out, like, can I still make it work? But it, <laughs> but this is Destination oh, fucked already. Okay, I'm just gonna amuse... I mean, I'm okay, okay, maybe some violent procs in Jasun. Maybe, you know... You can't do anything, you can try kill Molong or kill Harmonia. Oh, there goes Steel Marsh. There goes Steel Marsh. Chasun procs the violence too late though. Too late though. I mean, maybe if you violent here, you might be able to kill Harmonia. But <laughs> no, Ritesh says no. Ritesh says fuck you. <laughs> oh, well, another violent from Chasun, but this, the, to what end now? The Virat is never gonna be able to kill Ritesh ever. Yeah, I mean, it's yeah, gone already. Yeah, it's, it's already gone. <laughs> but good try anyway, I guess. But, uh, you know, here's what I think. Whoa, what the fuck? Back to the draft, right? Well, not really draft. It's good war, but it's still draft. But you can never... Don't... I don't think... For, I would never bring Varad into Ritesh. It's just... You're just asking for trouble. Because, I mean, you could... Thielmarsh is fine in a way, but is it enough damage? Look at this. This is like, what? We're talking about close to 50,000 HP, close to 50,000 HP, close to 50k. How much damage can Thielmarsh do? Not enough. You were banking on Thielmarsh to go three times and maybe still not kill a target, you know? So, you would need something else here, uh, and, and it cannot be water. Yeah, one Thielmarsh is more than enough water here. That's what I feel anyway. Yeah, for the first one, I think it was a pretty uh, safe-ish lineup to go with. Uh, maybe he should have focused on Iris or the Wind Monkey first, whichever, and kill it first. But he, he, he started on Iris and then he focused on the Wind Monkey after that, couldn't quite decide. And uh, the problem here with this lineup is that you don't strip that immunity off. It's even if you le even if let's say you can kill Iris and the Wind Monkey, there is a good chance that you get fucked up by Rakan because, I mean, you leave a chance to RNG to proc in the violence to fuck you up, right? That that can happen, yeah. So, I don't know. I, I, I think that uh, perhaps you could have gone Rakan as well. I, 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 don't, I think Rakan would be great because Rakan's fire and then you've got Wind here and then you've got this guy here. So you could have gone like Thessarian and Rakan and a Cleanser. Any cleanser would do because to get rid of uh, the stunts and armor break and whatnot. So, you, you, for example, if you go to Siren and Rakan, which he has, he could have gone to Siren armor break into Iris. Rakan collapsed, dead Iris, out of the picture straight away. Yeah, and then you kill the monkey, and then you you, you probably end up with a two or three v one situation against my Rakan, and you probably would have won that. Probably, I don't know. Maybe you tried Rakan before and got fucked, but uh, that's just how I would attack that. Yeah, uh, with, with, with a Rakan as well. For team number two, to be honest, you can just go with a super fast Immacity. And you will be okay, like Immacity Copper, right? Immacity Copper, you kill Ritesh, well your Copper has to do like 55,000. You kill Ritesh, if you don't kill Ritesh then you're fucked. But you kill Ritesh, and uh, you can go uh, Bulldozer onto Harmonia, but you make sure you kill Harmonia, if not you get you know, unwanted. You gotta have like the rules to be able to nuke like I would say 40 plus K for Harmonia and 55 for Ritesh to be on the safe side. Yeah, because there are good war towers and leader skill 
and then there's the glory point towers as well to factor in on top of the 40 plus thousand hp that we test already have so yeah that's the end of the video i wish come to us would one day let you see your guild war defense i think it's really interesting and it provides a source of entertainment to the user like i remember i used to uh, play a game i can't remember the name of the game where you built your own sort of dungeon well it's sort of like a floating island thing and people attack you your castle and you built your own dungeon you, you place the monsters and set traps and the, the 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 joy of that game was to log in uh you know every other day and look at your log and you see some people win you and you learn from that you change your defense so to speak or you know your, your traps and you look at people who fail and i don't know if you guys are you, you know i don't know what's the word for it sadistic <laughs> i don't know but it does bring me joy and entertainment to watch people get fucked by the you know the traps that i set the defense that i set so i do hope that this is going to be this will be a future uh this will be a feature in the future uh for good war defense arena defense and whatnot I'm not sure how much resources it will take, I'm no expert on that, but it would be really cool if this could be a thing. Yeah? That being said, uh, again, Matt Mac Gaming, uh, do check him out on YouTube uh, if you want to watch the whole video. Yeah, the link is in the description, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye!